Hi everyone and congrats on doing the Dubai 30x30 30 30 Fitness Challenge. My name is John Britton representing F45 Training Dubai Marina and Dubai Motor City. Today I'm going to take you through an awesome high intensity interval training workout um, and here's how it's going to work. We are going to do nine different movements today and they're going to sit in three different pods. You're going to do three laps of that pod. So you'll do the first one, second one, third one, and you'll go through that three times. Then we'll move to four, five, and six, and we'll do the same with seven, eight, and nine. Each set is gonna be 35 seconds of work, and you're gonna have 20 seconds to rest. I'm gonna go through the first three movements with you. Starting with number one, it's gonna be a squat to lunge. So we're gonna go down to a squat position. We're gonna lunge backwards, having that knee just above the ground, come back up, and then same thing on the other side, staying low the entire time. Number two, it's gonna be a jumping jack in place. So we're coming up, hands above the head, come back out. And number three, we're gonna be in a plank position. And we're gonna do an opposite reach. So we're gonna reach out and come back. Reach out and come back, keeping the butt low the entire time and not letting it get up in there. If you're ready, let's do this thing. We're starting in 10 seconds. Starting with that squat to lunge in three, two, one, and go. Lunging back, staying low in the squat position. Lunging back, lunging back. There you go. And just keep low. Imagine there's a ceiling just above your head. You never want to get up too high. Stay low the entire time here. Good, just 10 more seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. There's your first one. Number two, we have that jumping jack. You've got 20 seconds of rest. Just let yourself relax. Get that breathing under control. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Jumping jacks in place. Getting those hands right up above your head. And you really want to keep yourself moving the entire time here. There's no reason to stop on this movement. Try and get those hands above your head each time fully and come back. You got 10 more seconds. Keep going here. Jumping jacks in place. Almost there. And three, two, one, and relax. All right, so the next one we're going to get down on the bellies. We get that plank with an opposite reach here. Be on these elbows. You want the elbows right under the shoulders. We need that nice plank position. We're going in three, two, one. So we're reaching, opposite arm, opposite leg, keeping that butt low the entire time. On this one, do not forget to breathe. Fill that belly up every single time when you're reaching with that opposite arm, opposite leg. There you go, last 15, you're doing great. Keep it going. And good. And there's your first three. You're gonna do two more laps of that. Two more laps of that. So now we're going back to that squat with a reverse lunge. Remember on this one, we're getting that butt nice and low like we're ceiling above you. Three, two, one. Nice and low. Lunge backwards. Low, lunge back. You're doing great. Stay low the entire time here. Stay low. Big chest as you lunge back. Just let that knee either just lightly brush the ground or just above it. Back and forth, alternate those arms. You've got 10 more seconds. Let those legs burn a little bit. You got this. Almost there. Almost there. Hold on. Don't let yourself stand up. Two, one, relax. All right. We are back to the jumping jack. Back to the jumping jack. Starting in 10. And three, two, one. And 
go. So we're getting that hand right above the head. Come back down every single time. This is the jumping jack. Here you want to think, stay a little bit more on the ball of your foot. Let yourself go out and come back in. You're just going to keep hopping, keep moving, keep yourself moving. This one, there is some pace to it. There is some pace to it. You're almost there. You got 10 more seconds. Keep it going, keep it going. Keep moving those arms, moving those legs out together. And three, two, one, and relax. And we're back to that plank with an opposite reach. So we're back down. Again, make sure it's really important you get those elbows right under your shoulders so that your upper arm is vertical. So here, and then we're reaching with that opposite arm and the opposite leg. Come back and forth. Good. There you go, you're doing a great job. Keep it up, keep it up. You're halfway through the set. Keep moving here. Keep breathing, keep that tummy tight and tucked in, but don't let that butt get up in the air. You're just alternating. If you find this really tough, you can just not moving the arms and just Hold that plank there. Just keep breathing the entire And rest. All right, great job. There's two laps done of this first pod. We've got one more lap to go. One more lap to go. We're coming back to that alternating lunge from a squat position. We're gonna get down nice and low. Three, two, one. We're low and you're just coming back every single time. And you're just bringing that knee and come back up. Excellent stuff. If you're finding this really tough and you're starting to get tired, you can stand up and just do a reverse lunge. Stand up every time. It's going to take a little bit of tension off those legs if you are finding this really, really difficult. It's your last set of this. Keep it up for 10 more seconds. You're almost there, almost there. Keep pushing. Let those legs burn. Let those legs burn. You will not regret it. Two, one, rest. All right, great stuff, great stuff. Come back to that jumping jack. All right, on the balls of, the balls of those feet, we're moving nice and quick. Two, one, go. We got the jumping jack in place. And there we go, there we go. 25 more seconds of this, you're almost there. Almost there. Good. Keep going, keep those arms moving, keep those arms moving. 15 seconds, no reason to stop here. No reason to stop. Jumping jacks, moving out and in. You wanna go right to the last second. Two, one, rest. Rest. All right, we got one more movement here. One more movement in this first pod. We are in the plank with the reach. Starting in 10 seconds. Get down. And we're here. We're going in. Three, two, one. Plank and reach. Plank and reach. Back and forth. Good, good, good. Or just hold this plank like so. Almost there. Keep breathing through it. Keep breathing through it. Last 20 seconds. You've got this. You've got this. Tell yourself you can do it. 15 seconds. Don't let this plank come down. Don't let it come down. Squeeze. Squeeze through the entire butt, core. You're almost there. You're almost there. Three, two, one. And rest. And rest. You got a full minute to rest. So. What you're gonna do is we're just gonna demo the next three movements here. I'm gonna give this timer restart in just a second. So, our next three movements. We're gonna do two prisoner squats and entrance. For this one, prisoner squat, we're gonna go hands behind the head, big chest, we're gonna squat all the way down, come back up, one and two. Then we're gonna to go to an intro, we're gonna walk ourselves out as far as we can. Just remember, there's a point in no return. Do not pass that. And come back up. Two and one. 
For number five, we've got 10 high knees and two tuck jumps. We're gonna be here. We're gonna go 10 high knees on the spot and two tuck jumps. 10 and two high knees and tuck jumps. For number six, we've got the butterfly sit up. So we're gonna be here, feet together, elbows out, uh, knees out. We're gonna go back down, touch ground behind you, and then sit right up. All right. So that is pod number two. We're starting in 10 seconds. Get ready to go. Starting with the two prisoner squats plus the inchworm. Three, two, one, and go. Hands on the head. Coming down all the way in that squat. One and two. And then we're walking ourselves out as far as we can. And coming back up for those two squats. Two squats. Plus the inchworm. Walk way out. Walk yourself back up. If you can, on the inchworm, try not to let your knees bend. Walk out. Three, two, one. Awesome. Next one, we've got those 10 high knees and two tuck jumps. 10 high knees and two tuck jumps. This one is going to get you breathing really good. Really good here. Get ready. We're going in three, two, one, and go. Doing 10 high knees. And two tuck jumps. 10 high knees. If you have to, and you're finding these tuck jumps really tough, we can just go to little jumps. We're just coming up and go back to those 10 high knees. And rest, rest, good. I want to get you breathing. And so then the last one of this pod, we've got that butterfly sit up. So we're here. Knees down towards the ground. The reason we're doing this butterfly is take the hips out of it and use more of the abs. Going in three, two, one, and go. Touch the ground behind you. Come all the way up. Sitting back, working the core here. You can use your arms every time to let yourself chop back up. And come up there. You're almost there, 15 seconds of these. Good, you're doing great. And three, two, one, and rest. There's your first lap of the, first, of the second pod. We're gonna do that two more times. Two more times. So shake it out. Going back to those two prisoner squats, plus the inchworm here. Remember, we're going hands behind that head, chest is big, squatting all the way down. One and two. And let yourself walk way, way out and come back up. All right, so the two prisoner squats, one inch worm, keep going. 20 seconds right there. You want to get through this at least three times every set. Keep going, 15 seconds to go. Squat all the way down, try to keep that chest really big, hips to go down below the knees, and let yourself walk way right back up. You're almost there. In three, two, one. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let yourself rest here, let yourself breathe. Nice big deep breaths, fill your belly up every single time. 10 seconds to go. One, we got those 10 high knees. And then you got the two tuck jumps. 10 high knees, two tuck jumps. Bring those knees up nice and high. You want to be getting those knees as high as you can every single time. And the two tuck jumps, you just want to jump as high as you can. 10 and two, keep it going, keep it going. Remember, if you have to, you can take that tuck jump out and just do a really high jump in place. 10 and two, you're almost there, almost there. Keep going, your last five seconds, the buzzer. And two, one, rest. Great stuff, great stuff. We're coming back to the ground here for the butterfly sit up. 
get ready. You really want to think. In this 35 seconds, you can get at least 15 reps. Two, one, and go. Come all the way back, touch that ground, come all the way up. Remember, use your hands to sort of chop up a bit and come back up, working with butterflies sit up here. Keep going, keep going. Let yourself come right back. Touch the ground every single time and chop those hands up. Last 20 seconds, you're there, you're there. Keep going, shoot for that 15 rep target. 10 seconds to go, 10 seconds to go. Hold on, hold on, keep going. And three, two, one, good. That is your second lap. We're gonna do one more lap of this second pod. So let's get ready. We're coming back to the two prison squats and an inchworm. Ready, and two, one, go. One, two, and then let yourself walk the way out and come back up. Two prisoner squats, one inchworm, 20 more seconds. Almost there, almost there. Keep it going, keep it going, 15 seconds. Keep going, those prisoner squats, those inchworms, walk way out. Last few seconds, three, two, one. Good. All right, we're back to your favorite one here. Your favorite one coming up, 10 high knees and two tuck jumps. It's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing here. 10 and two. You just wanna make sure those knees go high every time. Don't get lazy on them. Three, two, one, and go. Those knees up nice and high. And then you got those two tuck jumps really high. 10 and two tuck jumps or knees. High knees and tuck jumps. There you go, there you go. Almost there, last 20 seconds. Last 20 seconds. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Let those knees come up nice and high and really try and get that tuck jump explode off the ground. Explode off the ground. Last few seconds. Two, one, and rest. All right, our last move in the second pod here. Last one in the second pod. We've got the butterfly sit up here. So get ready. We're going in three, two, one, and go. So you just want to come back all the way, touch that ground behind you, and then come on back up. You're doing a great job right there. Come all the way back. Come up. Use that core. 20 seconds left, 20 seconds left. Keep going, keep going. There you go, shoot for that 15 rep target. Less than 10, less than 10. And two, one, and good. Great work, there is your second pod done and out of the way. Pod is done and out of the way. Grab yourself some water, hydrate yourself, because we have one more pod to go. By 30 by 30, here we go. Our last pod, our last three movements. We're gonna start with something called the curtsy squat. So this last pod, we're gonna do a lot of lateral moving things here. Starting with the curtsy squat where we're tall, we're gonna take our knee, and we're gonna go back behind us, down to the ground and come back up. So we're in front, the chest is big, and we're gonna come down, bring that foot behind, and come back up to the curtsy squat. That'll be number seven, number eight. It's gonna be what's called an ice skater. So what we wanna do, again, we're moving laterally, you just wanna come on over onto one foot, pop to the other side. We're just moving nice and wide every single time, coming across on the one foot. Number nine, we have a side plank. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start here, and then I'm gonna let you know at the halfway point when we're gonna switch, you're just gonna move over, so I put my back to you, to the other side. So, last part of the day, make it your best part of the day and finish strong here. We're starting in 10 seconds. Let's get ready to do this. Start with that curtsy squat. 
that foot behind. Three, two, one, and go. Coming back, come back up. There you go. And again, moving laterally each time. Come back, coming up. If you look at it straight on, we're coming over, come back up. Great stop, great stop. You've got 10 more seconds. Good, good. All right, our next one, moving that ice skater. If you're like me, you grew up in Canada, this is a natural thing here. That ice skater going nice and wide. Popping over from side to side. We're going in three, two, one, and hit it. Coming over, coming over. Nice and wide, moving laterally each time. We're halfway through the set. Keep it up. Almost there. Two, one, and rest. Great stuff. We're moving to that side plank here. Going to work our core, work our obliques. Sitting on that elbow. We want that elbow right under the shoulder. Three, two, one, and we're up. And we're just holding the side plank here. Breathe through this. Do not forget to breathe. If your heart rate and everything is elevated, you got to just keep breathing. And fill your belly up every single time. Good, good, good. We're coming up to the halfway point. We're going to switch over to the other side here. Switch to the other side. Good. And holding that side plank. Holding that side plank. You're almost there. Don't let yourself come down. And two, one, rest. Awesome. Awesome stuff. There's your first lap. We're going to do two more laps of this thing. Two more laps. We're getting there. We're getting there. You're doing a great job. So we're coming back to the curtsy squat. We're going in three, two, one, and go. Come on down, come on back up. Getting that curtsy squat every single time. We're just moving laterally. You should be really feeling that front quad load up every single time when we're doing this curtsy squat. Halfway through the set, keep moving, keep moving. You're almost there, almost there. Keep it going. You've got just five seconds. Five seconds right here. Come on, hold on right to the buzzer. Two, one, rest. Good, good. And we're going to the ice skater here. Going to the ice skater, moving nice and wide. And get ready. We're hitting this in three, two, one and go. Ice skater, nice and wide every single time. If you can speed it up a little bit, speed it up. Good, 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 good. Good the first 10 seconds. Easy here, easy. Keep on moving, keep on moving. We got 15 seconds to go. 15 seconds. Keep moving laterally, nice and wide every single time. Use that foot to pop over explosively to the other side. Almost there, almost there. Go right to this buzzer in two, one, rest. Great stuff, great stuff. All right, and remember the next one. We're moving that side plank here. We're getting down, shoulder of this elbow here. Hips are coming up off the ground. Two, one, and up. And up. We're just going to hold that there. I want you to keep holding that. Keep holding that. Do that side plank here. You want to make sure you're just working the entire oblique and the core here. We're coming up on that halfway point. We're going to think about switching sides. Switch in two, one, and go. All 
right, you're on your other side, holding that plank. Holding it. You got 10 more seconds. 10 more seconds. Hold on. Hold on. Two, one, and rest. Great job. Great job. All right. We got one more lap of this thing to go. One more lap, three more movements, three more sets. You're doing a great job. You're almost there. You're almost there. Back to the curtsy squat in three, two, one, and go. Coming back, come back up. Curtsy every single time. You want to make sure this foot comes way to the other side of the other foot. Get nice and lateral every single time. Great work, great work. You got 20 more seconds, 20 more seconds. Keep pushing yourself, keep pushing yourself. Let those legs burn a bit. 10 seconds to go. Almost there, almost there. Great work. And rest, and rest. All right, back to the ice skater. Two more sets to go. Doing a great job here. Get ready. We're hitting this in three, two, one, and hit it. Coming up nice and wide every single time. Keep that pace going. Wide, back and forth. Ice skater here. Great stuff, great stuff. 20 seconds to go. Keep it up, keep it up. Got 15. Last 10 seconds, almost there. Keep moving nice and vertically, nice and wide. Nice and wide. In three, two, one, good. We got one last set here, one last set. One last set, we're going. This time we're doing that side plank. Doing that side plank. In three. One, and you're up here, you're up. Hold the side point. Great stuff, great stuff. 30 seconds, I'm gonna tell you when to switch sides. Tell you when to switch. Good, you're almost there, almost there. 20 to go, 20 to go. Keep moving, keep moving, you got 15. You're almost there, you're almost there. Last 10, keep it up, keep it up. Doing great. Doing great. And two, one, and rest. Great stuff. Awesome work. That is the high intensity portion of this workout. Now, if you've ever been in, into F45 with us, you know we sometimes throw surprises at you. In this case, we're gonna do what we normally do. It's gonna be a two minute plank. I can tell you're excited. Two minute plank, sort of work on the six pack within sort of six pack summer here. We're gonna start a two minute plank. We're doing this in 10 seconds. Get ready. We're gonna go with those shoulders right over those elbows. We're gonna be in a plank position. One, three, two, one, and go. All right, right here, we're holding this plank. Think of this as the best two minutes of your day. You can even give yourself, maybe a little hand here. I mean, you're doing a great job. You're taking your fitness into account. And just keep holding this plank here. Do not forget to breathe. Very important, obviously. Breathing, if you feel yourself shaking, that's fine. I'm shaking too. Just keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. You're almost there. We're getting through this. Keep breathing. Strong core, that's the name of the game right here. Connects the entire body, the upper body, the lower body, all that good stuff. We're almost there, almost there. Good, good, good. Now you want to just keep holding on, keep holding on. Keep everything nice and tight and squeezed. We've got our last minute here, last minute. Hold on, hold on. Feel yourself sweating? That's a good thing, you should be. You should be. There you go, there you go. Breathe through it, breathe through it. Don't let those butts get up in the air. Yeah. Keep it low the entire time. Keep pressing through those feet. Elbows right under the shoulders. You're almost there, almost there. And your 
last 30 seconds now, last 30 seconds. Hold on, don't let this plank come down, all right? Hold it, hold it, hold it. Here you go, here you go. You're almost there, you're almost there. Hold on, you got 10 seconds, 10 seconds. You're there, you're there. Wait for it, and down. There you go. Give yourself a hand for that plank. Even if you did drop and came back up, that's a very, very great little movement there. I can feel myself. I'm sure you can too. Just let yourself come out. We're going to do one stretch just to work on that core. So we want to be down. I want you to move to push-up position. And just press up and just let that core sort of stretch out a little bit. Let that spine relax and just breathe into that. You did just do a whole lot of core work here. Just hold on, hold on, hold on. And let your breathing calm down a little bit. That is a very F45 style workout we just did. And there is your 30 minutes a day. So I wanna say great job and thank you so much for joining me today. Together, we've collected our 30 minutes of activity. Remember that Dubai Fitness challenges, challenge, challenges you to collect 30 minutes for 30 days, which is very doable. You've got this. Don't be, forget to tag Dubai Fitness Challenge and the hashtag Dubai 30 by 30 when sharing your fitness journey. You can follow me and my studios. I'm at John M. Britton, and then I'm also at Dubai or F45 underscore training underscore Dubai Marina and F45 underscore training underscore Dubai Motor City. Thank you so much. I hope you have a fantastic day and great job on your workout.